Hello everyone. Hope you are doing well. In this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to create city traffic automated and how to use city traffic plugin in 3ds Max. It's car simulation plugin which helps us to create an environment of traffic. It's very easy plugin and it's so helpful in large scale environment. Before going to start, please subscribe my channel. So here is our scene. This is our road plan just for to understand. These are our cars model. You should have two separate car body and each tire. Every car should be into five parts one body and four tires. Your road plan surface should be into one part. If there are humps you should have to attach it in one object. So first we will adjust the cars. For this, go to the utilities. Click on more. Select city traffic. Then OK. Vehicle setup will be open. Now you have to select the car. It should have into 5 objects. After that just click on setup. So it will create the dummy box around the car. Now select the every car one by one and click on setup. So it will ready to use for city traffic plugin. When all cars dummy boxes is done. Now we have to make the copies of the cars. In utilities. Vehicle copy. Make the direction of copy. Click on do copy. Like this you have to make the copies. You can also change the number of copies. Like this you have to make the copies of each car setup. You car setup is done. Now on the road plan. You have to trace the road with spline or line tool. So I'm going to make the rectangular. Converting into spline. Select the vertex and break it. Now you can copy the spline and you can easily trace the road. As you can see, On the roundabout and the crossing areas. You have to create the circle.
After tracing you have select the road splines. Go to the modifier. Select the city traffic road. This command convert to the spline into road direction. In the modifier option, you can adjust the forward and backward steps. You can adjust the road width. Also you can adjust the speed. On the roundabout you also have to use the same modifier. Make the circle in one direction. And adjust the size. On the other road crossing or single areas. On the circle you have to use city traffic cross modifier. Adjust the circle. As you can copy the circle on other crossing. Or you can directly copy the circle all around the crossing spaces. Also on the roundabout. Make the crossing on all sides. Your road's indication is done. You can also add the other things like road signals and parking. In geometry, you have to go to the helper. Scroll down. And select city traffic. You can add the parking like this.
You can also add the traffic lights. You can turn on and off the signal according to your scene. And you can also make the stop line. With this plugin you can create the proper traffic environment. Adjust the time frame. In the utilities. Also have to adjust the time frame from here. Select the surface. Now click on trace. Tracing will be start. As you can see. It will take few minutes according to the time frame. Simulation is done. Play it. As you can see each place is working. Hope you will like this tutorial. Please subscribe my channel. For more informative videos and leave the comment for any question. Thanks for watching.